Hello, my dear students. This is your computer teacher, Mrs. Shring Wong Mubutia, back again with another lesson in computer subject. So today we are going to study about ICT, that is Information and Communication Technology. Via this video, we'll be covering ICT, its definition with some examples, components that builds up an ICT system, the role of ICT in various fields, especially in education sector, the technologies in ICT that are used for education and the advantages of ICT. So let us get started. When we talk about ICT, it is just an extensional term for information technology. That means it is just an extension of IT. Before we understand what is ICT, information technology information technology system study through information message store information like process receive So in this regard the systems that we are talking about is computers and telecommunications computers or electronic devices the say phone bio tablet bio laptop bio it is through these devices that we send and receive the information Ra, telecommunication here covers all the telephone lines and wireless networks just go through bara, chai, information exchange on just say hamile kunai pani message bhayo images bhayo sound bhayo basically kunai pani information haru lai chai pathaunu ya receive garnu sakcha now i've already told you that ict is just the extension of IT. Tese karan lega dakhari, it stresses on the role of unified communication. Now, your unified communication je hamili kosari achieve garsa bandakhari, it is through the integration of telecommunication ra computers. That's why ICT mache tiyo products ro include uncha, just go through barache, ami really electronic information or lai store gonu saksa, tiyo information la process gonu saksa, ra tiyo electronic information or ro pathaunu ra receive gonu saksa. Abo when we talk about examples of ICT, email or electronic mail can be an example because through email we may be able to send a content or any kind of information can be exchanged online classes is one of the most common example Rayo online classes ma ki huncha at one end teacher haru le afno electronic devices jastai computer bhayo phone bhayo laptop ma students haru ko lagi educational content haru prepare garcha ra using a wireless network they send that educational content to their students the students on the other end they use their electronic devices just the phone by you computer by you laptop go through but say the information I receive gorera the information go on us are say only notes prepare gonna sort of assignments or gonna sort now let us look at some examples of ICT through images. This is the first example. Now, your first example, we are using a wireless network through which various electronic devices are connected. The electronic devices like phone, computers are using the wireless network to exchange information. Another example can be that of E library or electronic library da yo e library ma chai hami harle hami ro textbook haru bhayo ra kunai pani textual data sound graphics videos haru chai digital form ma store ba ka huncha ra teachers bhayo students bhayo researchers bhayo basically any user can upload and use the information or utilize the information that is available in the third example i have shown you ICT systems that are used by people on almost daily basis. Just say WhatsApp, bio, Facebook, bio, Twitter, bio, Snapchat, bio. So these are all the examples of ICTs. Let us now move on to the other topic that is components that builds up an 
ICT system. This is the diagram for components of ICT. Here we are seeing that various technologies have been combined together which allows people, organization or business to exchange information or interact with each, each other in the digital world. The first component that we are going to study is data. So data bane ko chai, kone pani facts ya figures ho, just ko meaning unda inna. Basically, yo chai, it's just a collection of numbers, characters ya symbols, jo chai hami le code gare da computer lai input ko roop ma feed gar sa. Just the products ko price bayo, product ko weight bayo, these are all datas. The next one is hardware. Hardware are the physical components of the computer that we can see or touch. This is the monitor, keyboard, mouse, printer, these are all hardware. The next component is software. Software say it is set of instructions computer so that it performs a specific task. The next component is information. Raagi hamili input ko rupma junse data dincha. When this is processed and output is produced, that output becomes information. So information is basically processed data that has some meaning. It is basically the summarization of the data. Just a, a simple example would be that of timetable. The timetable ma say nunche subjects by you, periods by you, uh, timings by you, this all are data. When we give them and a timetable is produced or when we make a timetable with all the data, that timetable is becomes the information. And the last one is procedure. Procedure bani ko che, it is basically series of action that has been conducted in order to make sure the system runs smoothly. So these are the components that mix up an ICT system. The next topic is role of ICT in various fields. The first topic that we are going to study is education. These are the various stakeholders in education that can use ICT. So, ICT plays an important role in enhancing the quality of education. Ra education ma hamili ICT use garyavanche. It not only adds value to the teaching process, but it also adds value to the learning process. Teachers they can use ICT in order to research for their teaching materials or participate in online conference. It up to date learning materials or upload back on the internet ma they can use them to prepare their teaching materials or access or communicate with other teachers or professors from other university which in turn enhances the knowledge of particular subject. Ra, students are le che, internet use kare ra, unir ko study materials are prepare gano saksa, class notes are bayo, tiyo bun download gano saksa ra, discussion groups are join gano saksa, jas mat se unir ko friends are mate na bai ra, teachers are kone include bako uncha. Ra, ar ko important kura che ki u manda khari, students are le che, they can learn the subject at their own Pace. classes certain time limit just topic students are like But when we use ICT, it enables them to learn a particular topic at their own pace. So in regards to students, it enables or enriches the learning process through combination of videos, audios, images, text as well as animation. Researchers or do let's say about internet my area every day what we see is that up to date learning materials are being uploaded so they can use ICT in order to collect and process the data for the research process. When we talk about administration, it helps the administration in processes like data storage or knowledge management or decision making ma ICT use karnu saksa. So these are the various images where you see the students are making use of ICT devices in order to enhance their learning process and the teacher is also using the ICT device in order to impart the knowledge among the students.
the next topic is banking banking maje ICT controls the entire banking system that includes the electronic banking services this is currently Gadakhari it is also known as the nerve center of the banking system around the world so these are the images where we see ICT is being used by the customers in order to avail the banking services. Ra examples ma hami dekhi raha customers hole ki karna sakcha banda kari ICT ko through bola they can make transaction at 24 hour service centers like ATM. Businessman or relate ICT use kare they can save their time by doing online services bank administrator or let's say ICT use career they can control the entire banking system just a bill payment by you loan payment by your transfer this can be done by the use of ICT in the banking set sector which not only save times but also make the process easier the next field that we are going to talk about is e-commerce. Ra e-commerce bani ko chahi. Hami early junche goods ya products haru beshno ra kinnu lagi bancha. That is known as trading. But we when we use internet in order to do that process, that is buying and selling of goods, that is known as e-commerce or electronic commerce. Ra electronic commerce ma chahi. This are the various images just like you can see we have to do online shopping we have to do bio, amazon bio, or flipkart or go through bara, products or kincha or the products or payment or supplier like that is known as electronic commerce Ra, ICT use kar chai, customers le, they can connect with their suppliers in order to purchase certain products Ra, suppliers or le chai, feri ICT use kar ko products or yeah, transactions or go say track rock no socks employees or let basically they can communicate with their customers to sum up e-commerce through the use of ICTs helps in boosting the economy because let's say don't say buying or selling activities on the tell a faster or easier when I didn't the next field that we are going to talk about is health See, these are the examples. In health, ICT application have been valuable resources. In the manage, it supports the exchange of information between health professionals. Ra, the main objectives in health, the first one is to provide specialized healthcare consultation to patient in remote locations. You banda lage, ab hami le basti aur mai re bani ki unsa banda kare. Tholo tholo hospitals hunda ina, tholo professional doctors aur hunda ina. Ratya ko banchiram ta bimar unsa. Ra in order to communicate or connect with the big hospitals, they can use the ICT devices in order to consult with the professional health professionals. The next point is facilitating the video conferencing among healthcare experts for better care and treatment. ICT use kar chai, healthcare professionals or let's say patient ko records or like transfer gano sakcha so that quality of care provided by the health professional can improve. Then the next one is providing opportunities for continuing education of healthcare personnel again education ma hamile dekhe ki internet ma every day up to date research materials haru upload bhako huncha so the professional can make use of this materials in order to enhance their education in the health sector we can do various tests like ultrasound ct scan ecg with the help of ict in order to diagnose different diseases field that we are going to study is communication Ra ICT can be used for communication and exchange of information the same in the family DQ images or do bunch of do a car car song already ask us a touch my business after through the use of ICT tools like chatting email voice video conferencing social network just a Twitter by your Facebook by you WhatsApp by you I know and it is the ICT, it is the cheapest means of communication. 
next topic is role of ICT in education information and communication technology in education is the mode of education that uses information and communication technology to support and enhance delivery of information now we have already studied beforehand education maje just the different stakeholders so teachers for you students for your researchers for your administrators let's say kosari ict devices are use karnu sakcha so in this we are going to talk about various devices or technology in ICT that are used for education. The first one is online digital repositories. So is matchaiki unsa bandakari. It is basically a collection of online resources. It's your mechanism or just go through Balche Hamili digital container like manager store gonu soksa. So agi first ma ICT ko example se dakari we studied about e or electronic library where text data mate na baira hamili audio bayo videos bayo sound bayo digital form ma store gonu soksa ra various stakeholders like the students teachers researchers administrator can make use of the information that is there in order to enhance the their education or codes are access of course materials through mobile devices. Ra aile ko time ma hamili par hero pare bani ki unsa banda kare. Jaise online education portals aur usa Sikkim Edutech cha, hamne Sikkim ma hai na. Tyaani ra teachers aur liki garsa banda kare. We upload our educational content in the form of tutorial classes, videos unsa notes aur usa notes aur usa jo PDF format ma unsa tyo hamili upload garsa. The students can use their mobile devices like phones, tablet, remote areas para unarle tiyo course materials ya tiyo education content naru access karnu soksa. Next one is flipped classroom concept. Ra the as the name suggests, it is just the opposite of normal or traditional teaching concept. Ra aile ko teaching concept ma cha ke cha banda kari. Hami teachers aru le cha students aru like classroom ma yera topic bujaun cha. Ra the topic related homework or assignment in the flipped classroom concept ma chai hami early students are like lectures or by educational content or online devices or online services go through but it's a sent cursor just the whatsapp by you email go through but the students now has to go through that educational content at home and understand as per their capacity the next day class ma aira chai only a discussion or workshop happens regarding or related to that topic so as much as we see the learning capacity of an individual student the last one is as normally we see we make and make use of handheld computers tablets by your audio players by your projector devices by your in imparting the education these are the images for technologies that are used for education. Now let us move on to the last topic for this video that is advantages of using ICT. Now we see that ICT has been used across various industries from telecommunication to marketing to education. So it has various advantages. The first one is communication. The communication must say we can save time, speed, money because it is much easier to move or carry the information around. The next advantage is globalization. The ICT has not only brought the countries and people closer together, but it has also allowed the world to be a single interdependent system. The next advantage is cost effective. Since most of the businesses has become automated, it makes them cost effective. Or could her advantage greater availability. The ICT has made it possible for businesses to be automated giving clients access to website as well as information 24 hours a day and seven days a week the next advantage is bridging the cultural gap now is much a greater access to technology has helped to bridge the cultural gap by people from different cultures to communicate with one another they can also exchange their views as well as ideas
Next advantage is creation of new job. The best idea of ICT has been creation of new and interesting job. The next uh, advantage is education. Education ma we have already discussed most of most of the advantages. The internet can be used to create various educational opportunities. Just the images mate number animation, video, sound, we can teach our students which helps in improving the retentive memory of our students. Through ICT the teachers can also create interactive classroom so that the lessons are more enjoyable so that was the last topic for the day in this video we have studied about ICT its definition with some examples components that builds up an ICT system the role of ICT in various fields like education banking e-commerce health and communication and we have also studied about various devices and technology in ICT that are used for education and lastly the advantages of using ICT. The notes for the same topics will be sent in your WhatsApp group that has been created. So I request the students to download the document and then jot down the notes in their computer copy. If you have any doubts regarding any topics that we have discussed in this video, you can always call me or send me message in my WhatsApp number. Thank you.